good evening let's go to today's market nifty ended up in the negative 11752.80 34.35 points in the negative 0.29% in the negative opened around 11856.15 which is the all time high today and that is also the high today and today's low is around 11738.50 and let's go to my prediction review in my prediction the key level which is 11859.70 and the average level from the positive side to the average level so this level from the those average which shown 11859.70 that level is not broken if it is not breaking then market will come down that is what happened today it has came down from that level and somehow it is able to manage to break the overall average around 11757 somehow it is not able to break the support level 1 if you take the average of overall average and the support level 1 which is almost today's low 11741.252 today's low is around 11738 something Uh, and uh, after that it has closed in the range of overall average 11752 let's go to the prediction for monday friday is holiday monday the ratio indicating negative 2 is to 3 uh, and average indicating negative 0 is to 3 and weightage indicating negative 1.56% versus 3.82% and absolute frequency indicating it all indicates in the negative but the ratio is uh, one point difference normally if it is comes we need to watch out carefully and trade and 74.42% chances to end up in the negative 25.5% chances to end up in the positive whenever the all four key indications indicating one side means opening we must need to watch out if the opening is supporting the negative even a point opens in the negative then we can hold the position for a long and uh, we may get some profit if the market is opens in the positive even a point then we need to play cautiously even uh, book the profit on the opening itself on the safer side let's go to the uh, range which shows that opening hours we need to watch out in the flat negative itself shows around 110 points in the negative overall 82 83.62% uh, points in the negative on the range which shows uh, resistance and support levels uh which is on the uh, level of uh, high uh, resistance level 1 itself around 125 points and the support level 1 itself 115 points which means we don't have the key absolute frequency as well uh, so we all depend on depends on how the market is going to open at the same time we need to watch out those key average levels which is uh, that 11765 Uh, 0.70 that level we need to watch it whether it is breaking uh, with the other 10 point means it market will go in the bullish and even it may reach once again 11878 on the other hand even it may go up to this average resistance level 1 and the uh, previous closing 11815 if it is able to open in the flat positive means because four indication shows negative but the opening is not supporting the negative means it may have a chance to end up in the positive and close in the positive and the key in, uh, for the bearish trend which is around 11451 which is too far away from the previous closing which is almost 300 points so what it is indicating if the market is not opening in the negative uh, then uh, no matter how and where it is going to trade even for example uh, if it is trades uh, uh, somewhere in the negative after opening positive also it may come down towards to some extent of maybe 50 points 60 points in the negative somehow it will manage to go towards to the positive that is what this indicates 11451 why because this is the turn around point level and the bear is to stay in the point uh, for example Uh, if it is opening on the flat positive or flat negative if if it is on the flat negative we are going to hold the position for long we may try to book somewhere around 11624 or maybe 11637 or maybe in those four any ranges uh, even 200 points also possible if the market is opens on the flat negative on the other hand if the market is opens on the flat positive it may have a chance to resist somewhere in the average of previous closing to 
support level 1 as well around 11,695 and turn around from that particular level if the market is open from the flat positive Though that, that is the two different things why because it is too far away uh, if the, those points are having huge gap means market may have a chance to support at any level it may get support in the support level one it may get support in the overall average it may get support anywhere in between in between those average that is the reason first anyone wants to go for a buy they need to go with the stop loss of 10 points from this level and go for a buy around 11,695 if the market is open so on the positive and then it come down towards to the negative means if the market is opens in the flat negative then this step may not work uh, sometimes it will work sometimes it may get the stop loss and go further negative side due to uh, we have the ranges all or in the high in the negative side so it is all purely depends on how the market is going to open it is very simple if the market is opens in the positive side play with the stop loss of uh, even in the previous closing or in the average level and buy it is very simple as that and if it is opens on the negative flat negative then play with the stop loss of 5 to 10 points in the in the previous closing and go for a short or maybe in the average of resistance level 1 and the previous closing go for a short 11,815 let's see how the market is going to give us on Monday thank you